Connor Pugs fell off. So, it's 2020. The pandemic happens. Everyone is locked in their homes. Minecraft YouTubers start going viral left and right. But something is different about this new generation of content creators. Because they have cultivated a rabid fan base of the cringest people imaginable. And this audience starts turning on these creators. Canceling them for every innocuous comment they make. Any perceived beliefs they may or may not have had. Had petty drama like voting for squids in in Minecraft and commentary channels decide this is the perfect time to strike this is perfect content. One of those people was obviously me, and another one of those was Connor Pugs. Connor Pugs was basically your run-of-the-mill commentary channel, kind of similar to Optimus. He basically just kind of talked about things over gameplay, which is what every other commentary YouTuber does. His content wasn't really, like, amazing or anything, but I genuinely like to hear the guy's opinions and like to hear the guy talk. However, at, at one point, he, he decided to, like, stop. He decided to, like, quit milking the whole Minecraft YouTuber bullshit man and, and I'm pretty sure it, it was because he like had to go to college or something So I remember at one point he kind of like quit YouTube for a bit Then he like came back and now his content has just become like absolute brain rot, dude What is this? How is this real content, dude? Two hours the cringiest kid on planet earth Skibbity phantom tax spoiled brash hours once a year kid can't stop saying what the sigma gets suspended Like how is this real? He uploads this every day daily content on whatever this is my babysitter did something disgusting we should f dude he's he's really trying to get the 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 child viewers that's what this is he's appealing to kids with this i i, I genuinely don't understand like how you make this content like okay i get that like commentary isn't necessarily like the greatest content imaginable it's pretty soulless in of itself especially if you're kind of like a commentary content farm but like how does <laughs> How does it turn into this? Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we have a story time of a kid who- I swear, it sounds like this dude is like, he's like in his car or something. Like he just got out of class and he's just sitting in his car with his like phone. And he's like, yo guys, today we're gonna be talking about this kid who did some skibbity sigma in Minecraft. Who took TikTok brain rot just a little bit too far. And by a little bit too far, I mean actually getting suspended from school from refusing to speak like a normal human. You guys might be thinking that the title seems Dude, absolutely sounds ludicrous. So like, dead no inside. way a kid got suspended from school for saying, uh, erm what the sigma? Like, no way a kid actually got suspended. I just, I, I cannot comprehend. I, I, I cannot believe that this is a real person. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And today I'm gonna be telling the story of how this kid got kicked out of school and shot by his parents because he wouldn't stop saying, erm, what the Sigma. This is totally Sigma toilet, guys. Just listen to the story. It actually makes more and more sense because this this kid is like not only has TikTok brain rot but is actually insane. So yeah, with that being said, leave a like in the video right now I'm to claim your leave free like, nothing. I'm limited I'm time sorry. offer, pretty good. I and just, uh, with I that being said, I let's just jump like right this. into it. So anyways, TikTok brain rot, man, it's a real thing. Is he gonna it's, say it's not good. toilet? And the youth these days, man, I feel I I sound like an 80 year old man saying the youth. Kind of sounds like I'm about to say back in my day. Well, back in my day. We had plenty internet brain rot in our own rights, but somehow this is worse. No, nah, MLG was better than whatever the fuck this is, dude. This is brain rot. Your content is brain rot. You're part of the problem. Like, it's kind of funny that, I don't know, I feel like people who grew up in my generation of like 2016, 2017 internet, like we had plenty of stupid things that we said, but for some reason, like this generation word. is like, the brain rot is worse. I can't tell if it's this old man syndrome from my end or if no. it is genuinely worse. Either it way, that really worse, doesn't matter. Yeah. In fact, that kind of does doesn't matter at all. What's important is that recently, uh, brain rot has just gotten really bad. Like, uh, I, I think it was uh, brought on to us from a skibbity toilet, which- He did it. He said the thing. He said skibbity toilet, guys. How is this a 13 minute video, dude? A serial killer. See, it could be worse.
course, but he just happened to be kind of cringe. This, he said it like full volume. He just said, erm, what the Sigma, like full volume. I'm sorry, dude, but what the fuck is this? Connor, what are you doing, dude? What are you doing, man? Like, you are far too attractive to be making this content. What are you doing, dude? There's literally anything else you could be doing, okay? I don't care if you're making garbage content, but this is way too garbage. This is just awful in every single conceivable way, and there is no way that you can enjoy this. I, I refuse to believe that you look forward to every single day, sitting down, recording, talking about some kid getting kicked out of school for saying, what the Sigma? There, there, there's no way that you're passionate about that. And by the way, his YouTube shorts are even worse because he just steals content, which I didn't even know was a thing because like a minute, um, 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 a minute, like it's only a minute long video that you have to make and you're literally just ripping someone else's content. Luke went too far. Giant red song is crazy. Play with us. Spicy went too far. I forgot in a fight. Cats are so he's basically just like, PewDiePie did something crazy and then he just plays no dogs someone else's better. video. This is my best friend Shutters time. and he loves dogs. Look, I'm willing to hear them both out, but I'm kind of on Shutters side. But I think cats are way better. So today we're gonna figure out which one is better. Level one, who listens better? Kind of like a weird criteria, but okay. Dude, this guy is making Sniper Wolf reaction videos, but in short form. This is Spicy's craziest challenge. I, I don't know. I don't know why you do this to yourself, Connor. So even with the shorts, even with all the brain rot clickbait, he's only gotten 1.5 million views in, in the last 30 days. Now, I don't know how much of that is from shorts, but it does seem like shorts are his heaviest, heaviest hitters for the most part, which which makes complete sense. Now, it's entirely likely that these have like fuck tons of ads and he has like good like CPM, but with the views on this, like there there's no way that he's making more than like a thousand, like a thousand dollars a month, maybe a couple thousand, maybe. Like, is it really, is it really worth it? You know? Sure. Commentary content is brain rot as fuck. And, and maybe he just didn't like the toxicity of it all. Maybe he didn't want to be known as the guy who talks about controversial shit. I get that. I understand that. But like, at least with the commentary content, I felt like you were kind of a person who was actually like kind of talking about stuff that maybe you were somewhat interested in at least a little bit. But this shit is just brain rot, dude. This is awful. <laughs> okay. This is bad content. It's garbage. I don't understand. What happened? I miss the old Connor pugs. Okay? The the Jacksepticeye comment section makes me sick, Connor Pugs. The I feel awful for Jaden Animations, Connor Pugs. Which, um, I think I- Did I steal the title for those? For my technoblade video. That right there, that bullshit, that's why commentary content could get kind of fucky when you're making like shit like that on a guy who got cancer. Oh god. I'm just making this video to say, Connor, please come back to the light. There's still plenty of Minecraft drama to milk. There, there, there's plenty of, of commentary videos to make. I promise that even if you don't like it, it's more fulfilling than talking about what this skibbity sigma or, or whatever. I'm just like, I'm just shocked. Because this is a guy that like I I, I used to I used to actually watch his content from time to time. And now I'm looking at his channel and it's like, what the hell, what the hell is this like turned into? What is this? What happened? And it's kind of, it's kind of concerning. Are you okay, Connor? Did something happen to you? Have you been kidnapped? Are you, are you forced to make these videos by aliens? All right, does the sniper wolf have you at gunpoint? Anyway, if you guys have enjoyed this video, hit that like button down below, subscribe to the channel, and I am out.